Welcome back to Western New York Living. It's that time of year again when flowers are blooming, birds are chirping, and motorcyclists are back on the road. So it makes sense that May is Motorcycle Safety Awareness Month. And joining us this morning is an avid motorcyclist and also an attorney at the William and Tara Law Office, Christopher Gresham. Christopher, thanks for being here. It's my pleasure to be here. Thank you. Well, as a rider, I, I know you're happy that the firm is behind motorcycle uh, awareness and road safety. And I know you've probably seen some tough accidents in your day. Yes, we read about various fact patterns every day. The legal team, as well as uh, myself, we're aware of some of the things that lead to a crash. Uh, and May is Motorcycle Safety Month as well as Women's Riders Month. So we're happy to advocate for safety uh, this month. How, how long have you uh, been riding yourself? About six years now, uh, just over six years. Uh, my wife is largely responsible for me getting into that. She uh, is from West Virginia and I went to a ride with her dad and came home and said, hey, I'm getting a bike. And a few days later, it's in the driveway. <laughs> and the next thing you know, I'm riding her bike around the neighborhood, practicing starts and stops. And then I've been an avid motorcyclist ever since. All right. Are there any similarities, by the way, to being a biker and an attorney? Well, I'm able to answer questions of my fellow riders uh, about the various laws and personal injury laws. And I'm also able to answer questions from the general public. Uh, about what it is to be a biker uh, and motorcyclist. And, and, you know, people have this image uh, maybe from television what a biker is, but here's an attorney. There's, uh, all walks of life are on motorcycles now, and we have to be aware. What are some safety tips for those of us in cars who are not riders to be aware of with riders on the road? Be patient, look twice, and save a life. Uh, we tend to ride in groups, but some of us uh, will ride solo because we enjoy doing it. But just look twice. Take time. You don't have to race up on a motorcyclist. Uh, we need spacing to be able to maneuver for road hazards, things of that sort. Uh, but just look, check your mirrors uh, and make sure you're not turning left across traffic w when there's oncoming traffic, whether it be a car or uh, a motorcycle. Yeah, certainly be more alert this time of year. There's more motorists on the road and the motorcycles are out on the road also. But for those who ride motorcycles or those who are new to it, any tips for riders out there um, as they get on the road more often? Ride to your ability. Uh, as you go along in your rider career, you get more experience, you, be get, more, you get more comfortable, but don't over extend yourself and ride when you're not in full control of the motorcycle that you have. Be patient and be aware. This is one of the many um, awareness programs William Matar and the law offices and all the attorneys and staff there are a part of here. And uh, what does it mean to you as an attorney at the William Matar law offices to be part of this program? But uh, every month you guys have an awareness program going on. I'm honored to be here representing not only the law offices of William Matar, but also my fellow riders uh, to bring public safety awareness uh, to uh, all the viewers. Yeah, certainly preventing accidents uh, is great for everyone's business Absolutely. Uh, when it comes to that. So, Christopher, thank you so much for joining us here. Have a great, safe riding season. Thank you very much. My honor and, to be here. Yeah, as the weather uh, warms up here and, and riders like to get on the road, if you'd like to find out more information on how you can stay safe on the road during motorcycle season and all the other community programs the William Matar Law Offices are part of, head to their website, williammatar.com. There you'll find useful tips for motorcycle safety. And, of course, you can find out more about all the services and resources the William Matar Law Offices offer. Now coming up next, Spectrum Health and Human Services will be joining us to talk about some of the wonderful services they offer for individuals dealing with mental health and addiction issues. We'll be right back. This segment of Western New York Living was sponsored by the following.